Hoover police have arrested two more suspects following last Friday's deadly shooting at the River Chase Galleria Mall near Birmingham. King Williams and Demetrius Jackson Jr. are both facing capital murder charges this morning. They are being held in the Jefferson County Jail without bond after surrendering to police. Montez Coleman also facing capital murder charges. He was arrested on Friday. Eight-year-old Royte Giles Jr. was killed when an argument inside that mall turned violent. Three others were also caught in the crossfire. The deputies have arrested a man for murder more than a month after a brutal beating in Escambia County, Florida. Andrew Missel is charged with murdering Melissa Toady. Her body was found at Tough Shed on Pensacola Boulevard, May 23rd. Witnesses reported seeing Missile going into a shed there with a large stick and hearing the victim screaming for help. The medical examiner said today that, uh, that Toady died of asphyxia with blunt force injuries to her head and torso. Mobile police warning the public about a fake MPD Facebook account. This page, created on Tuesday, is not affiliated with the department. An easy way to spot the fake account is the low follower count. The real MPD page has more than 38,000 followers. This fake one has a couple hundred. The fake page is using offensive and profane language, something the Mobile Police Department promises to never use on social media. The department says it will hold the person responsible. Beware, we are looking for you. If we can find you, then we're going to use every means we can to hold you accountable for your negligent behavior. Another post from the bogus account jokes about officers taking advantage of the coronavirus pandemic to fill quotas. A department spokesperson said making arrests and issuing tickets is not MPD's priority during the pandemic.